Meredith, I love you. Today, in the presence of God, our family and friends, I give myself to you in marriage. You are my best friend. I promise to support, encourage you in whatever you pursue in our life together. I promise to love you when life is easy and especially when it is hard. I promise to be patient with you. Do you hear me? I'll be patient with you. I promise to your parents that I will take care of you and protect you because I know that you will always be their little girl. Most importantly, I promise to make you laugh because that's what brings me the most joy in our life. I love you and I can't wait for you to be my wife. If you had told me the night on the beach in Port Orange, Florida, that we would be standing here a short four and a half years later, I honestly wouldn't have believed you. Today, you've become my husband. Words I actually can't believe are coming out of my mouth. I knew you were the one when I watched how you treated your mom the first night I met her. I knew that a man who has that much respect and love for his mother would be a man who would always hold my heart in his hands the same way. These past few years have without a doubt been the best years of my life so far. I am so proud of how we have grown together as a couple and as individuals. I know that growth will only continue as husband and wife. I love you more today than I ever have, and I promise to show you that love each and every day. I promise to support you through life's beautiful moments and through the tough ones. I promise to always be patient with you. I promise to put your needs before my own most days. And I promise to try to do a better job of picking up after myself. I can't wait to love you forever. Brad Meredith, before God, and in the presence of this congregation, you have made solemn vows to each other. You have confirmed your promises by the joining of hands and by the giving and receiving of rings. Therefore, I proclaim that you are now husband and wife. Blessed be the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit now and forever. Those whom God has joined together, let no one separate. Brad, you may kiss your bride. <laughs>